Hold on, let me get this set up. Hey guys, happy St. Patrick's Day. How have you guys spent it? Has it been good? Um, it started raining here today. Yeah, first spring rain. I'm pretty excited. That means the flowers are coming and the snow is finally going away. <laughs> um, I'm wearing my best friend's jacket right now, so I feel pretty and I feel pretty damn special. He means the world to me. And if he watches this, I love you. Okay, now, there are a couple things I just wanted to address. One, have you ever felt that you were being betrayed by your own mother? I know I love my mom, but sometimes it just feels like she doesn't have the best for me, right? That she doesn't know what I want in life, and even though I've tried to explain it to her, that she's not going to understand. I live a very hectic, hectic lifestyle. I, you know... I ran away from home when I was 16 years old, and um, all throughout my life I've just tried to make things difficult, just more of a challenge. Even in school, I was that bad girl, as you might have known in one of my other videos, my whole reputation. But um, my own mother, I guess, I love her, I love her to bits, and I do. Sometimes it just, you know, I don't always get along with my mom, and that's one of the reasons why I don't live with her. Yet, I still do love her. I will always love her. She'll always be my biggest hero, my biggest fan, you know. She's tried to do me so many good things in my life, and I've just burned them and, you know, reducted them, redundant them, whatever you want to call it. And I guess I just wanted to say sorry. Sorry, Mom. I do love you. And I know sometimes I get on your nerves and I drive you up the wall because it doesn't seem like I know what I'm doing in life. Well, sometimes, you know, I don't. Life is this big, big thing. It's, it's hard. It's, it's scary. It's ridiculously, you know, it's out there. It's going to be, it's going to be that one thing that you never really get over. That one obstacle in your whole existence that you're still going to be fighting 40 years down the road. Um... I just wanted to say, guys, that your mother can be your worst enemy. And for four years, I honestly thought that she was. Now that I'm starting to grow up a little bit, starting to, you know, get into, like, stupid relationships, find stupid friends who don't even care about me, um, you know, my mother's my biggest friend, too. <laughs> Not that big. She'll, she'll kill me for calling her fat. Wait. <laughs> Or fat. <laughs> um, yeah, that's all I wanted to do was just, you know, throw a shout out to my mom there. Everybody should have a shout out to their mom. Um, if you guys haven't already, watch Chris Crocker's video at It's Chris Crocker. Just Google that or YouTube it and uh, watch your videos because they are the best. Okay, um, just, you know, peace.